Hey guys, good morning, it's Dominic Zen, and today I just wanted to show you uh, just how quick it can be to create a landing page with the EGN marketing system that I started using. Um, right here, I am in my EGN back office. Uh, if you've never been in here, you know, first time seeing it, you normally, generally, will start over on this screen when you log in, the five simple steps. You're brand new you just start go through these step-by-step -step instructions and uh, it'll take you through everything but you know real quick this should be quick easy I hope um, we're just gonna go and create a quick landing page uh, you know see just how long it takes me to do this so what I'm gonna do is come down here to create site or create landing pages this is all new and you got to uh, create landing pages create site your site so I got something in mind so I'm gonna go and create a site I'll just start it from scratch so I'm gonna I'll use this for demos in the future okay that's weird um, what's your site domain we're just gonna put uh, website DEM demos um, and then the title this is so you can uh, this will be a descriptor so you know what the heck you're uh, looking at and I'm just going to do, do the same thing web site DM demos this down here uh, around there, right there it's all the wording is all whited out right now uh, Kevin will have to change that but it says I would like my site to appear in search engines and in public listings around this network well if you're building it uh, you can change that later, but since you're building it and it's going to be, you know, uh, under construction, you may not want that to happen. So we just go click no over here to click create site. Give it a second. All right, boom, we've got our website. Congratulations, you have successfully registered a new website. There's your website. Uh, uh, right there a couple ways to get to it you can either click the link or you can come down here you know to create landing pages go to your sites just do it this way and you can see bada bing website demos ooh I spin uh, alright and all we're going to do is come in here click on your website demos it's going to pull this up. All this is going to be changeable, but this is the default what pops up. This is what? This is a WordPress style website setup. I'm not all that familiar with all that type of stuff. So, But we're just going to come under here to uh, go to your dashboard. All right, and this brings you into the back office for that particular site. As you can see right here, website demos. Ad, uh, ad, uh, WordPress admin. So what I'm going to do is let's see, click pages. It's going to show you all the pages there. You got sample page. I'm not going to worry about that. We're just going to create add new. Enter the title, and we're going to just call it uh, uh, landing page one this can be changed at any time all you gotta do is come back up in there click the box you know oops there it is I want to change it make your you know make your make your adjustments and then it gives you your little link right there afterwards you want to save it boom uh, you can publish it you can publish it now publish it later up to you uh, and then to edit, we just go under here, edit with Thrive Content Builder. And boom, this is the website we just popped up. All right. Any of this, everything in here is editable. So real quick, like I said, I'm, I'm just doing a quick and dirty, you know, show you how quick this can happen. We want to choose a landing page. And you got up like 200 different options back here 
Uh, let's see, I had one in mind. You successfully five minutes to the. This is the one I'm looking for right here. The mini squeeze with the bridge. I think that's what I want. We'll use that anyways. Okay, let's get that out of the way. Get back, we'll stuff you up over here in the upper corner. All right, boom, boom. Yes, this is what I was wanting. All right. So what we got here, this is this is the beginning of our website. And uh, first off, I want to change the background picture. So we come back up under here, landing page, go to landing page settings, and background image. And let's see, media library, we got nothing in here. Upload files, insert from URL. This is how, let's see, this is going to be... The only hard part about this, guys, is I gotta go find my uh, the picture I want, and it's normally for me. It's gonna probably wind up being in here in my downloads folder, so this may take a little few seconds. Because uh, this folder is just so huge, but you know I didn't not want to go and re up you know make this and re upload you know. And, upload everything beforehand for this video so at least you get to see uh, you know just how quick and easy this is when you know what the heck you're looking for okay let's see oh, ba -ba 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 -ba. And of course I didn't I wasn't smart enough to rename the folder or the photo I wanted to use Okay. What was that? Nope. Uh, no. All right. Where are you? Are you kidding me? Ay, ay, ay. Figures. When you want to find something, you're never going to be able to find it. Oh, right there. There's one. You gotta be kidding me. I'm missing the one I really wanted to use. Oh, well, let's go find the one I just had. Oh, I'm probably blowing through it, blowing past it. Ah. Uh. Okay, there it is. It's loaded. Insert into post. Boom. That's what I was wanting. That's one of them. That'll work. We can get moving again. All right. Um. Boom. We changed the uh, background. I like that. Uh, we can go back. We can go in there and edit it. Should be able to. No, we can't. You can't on this one. Landing page settings, background clear. Yeah, this is what I was wanting right here. Static image. That way, if this if this was a larger window, um, ah, shit, I'll just leave that up there, and it, it could scroll. The image would just stay right where it's at. All right. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna click the background box here, and of course, this is in the way again. We'll move you back down over there. We're gonna come over here. Uh, let's see, nope, 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 nope. I'm gonna come here to the palette, background color, and I want to change the opacity. Something about like that. That'll work. <clears throat> I just don't want it so blacked out. I want to be able to see a little bit through to the background. Um, come in here. These are all your context. 
your, your this is a uh, text box and I don't want this oh that's sort of cool five minutes to higher conversion rates but I want mine to say skies oh, skies the limit Let's get rid of all this other stuff. Guys, the limit. And then I want to come down into this box. Delete all that. And I just want to go discover the, this was stupid. That is helping. Thousands of E N T R E P R E N D U Mars build and, and this I'm taking off of a, another uh, pre built uh, site we have businesses. All right, and then dun dun dun. Okay, I want that, that, start download, clicking the button, and, uh, I don't know, yellow? Eh, yellow just really ain't my thing, personally, but, let's see, well, first, let's see, the components, dimensions, I want centered, margins and paddings, this one have the different, you can also go in here, <clears throat> excuse me, and uh, this one you may not be able to change the style of the uh, of the button. I don't think you can with this particular one. Edit components, text, submit button. Eh, it'll work. I just don't like. <clears throat> I'm just particularly not fond of the button color. think that was orange eh, looks yellow to me how about blue we'll go with that blue that works it sort of blends in with everything it sort of goes with the flow of everything else um you got this here this is your little we respect your privacy email address will never be shared or sold statement i want to change that from the gray text color we'll go just make that a little bit more visible and down here we need to change this okay there's a little grabby thing to move that so you can see it and what I want to do here do the same thing the gray is nice but with that background it sort of stinks so all I'm going to do is brighten that up a little bit maybe uh, hit OK but I want to come in here too by Acme Inc. Ah. This is going to give you your year. I can barely see that. How about we try? No. No. That is just a bad positioning for that, but. How about we go darker? White. And we'll do purple, why not? And then we're just gonna come in here and brand it. Remember, when it comes to the disclaimer and stuff down there, brand it to you. Whatever your website is, whatever your business is called, make sure it's it's you and not somebody else. Like, you know, your sponsor, my sponsor has keep it simple. Uh I don't want that down there if I'm promoting me because that promotes that sort of branding it more toward her that this is where those share Cody things come in and that can be a bad thing all right we respect your privacy blah 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 and uh, one thing we did not do connect with service this allows you when you come in here this is where you connect up your autoresponder I'm using a Weber so this is it's Aweber's an API. 
the next step you don't have any API integration set up click here to, to set up a new API connection and add new connection select an app Aweber Boom. For me, it was that easy because I already have it integrated uh, on another one. Just hit done. You error logs. Okay. Now, what did you do to me? I got to get back to my pages. I think page one. Edit. Oh, frick. Okay, well, gra crash and burn, folks. Forgot to save. <laughs> All right. Mm. Well, we're catching that one, and this is. I uh, don't know. I don't want this. You already saw me start uh, going through this, so I'm just going to quickly go back through and put this back to where I had it. Oh, hit the green button. Hit the damn green button. Uh, now I feel freaking stupid. But. Oh, come on, you dumb thing. Uh, okay, no. I'm the dumb one right now. Oh, frick, but that's fine. This will only take a minute. Oh, great. Where am I on this? Give me one quick second and I'll have this. Come on, you. Click in there. There we go. All right. Yes. System. Okay, boom, save. All right, we want to do this. But wrong thing right there. I want to do this. I think we went with blue. Okay, down here with this. Uh, made that takes color. Bring that up there more to a white. Okay, come on, let's go down here. I can't see all that. I think we want purple, and then this here in the brackets will put the the current year, and we're gonna put that. Boom, boom, boom. Save that. That was supposed to be purple. Come on. Work with it. With, work with me here, system. There we go. There we go. And let's see. It's, you notice right below my photo, it's going ding, ding, ding. It's same. All right. I think that's where we were just at. Then we come back, did this, and connect with service. All right. Create new connection. It was an API. Uh, I don't want that. These are all the different lists I have. In my uh, Aweber, so we're going to EGN Marketing. Let's save, and now that that's done, Aweber, what do I want to show? I want to show uh, the name, email, 
No, I don't want to show. I want to show the. I want the name and I want the email on these, and they're required fields. All right. Uh, if you have, a, if you want to set up a captcha, you can do that. Uh, redirect account. If you want to do that, you click that. Ah, dang it. Oh, I'm at the bottom of the thing. Move me. Get that out of the way. After the form is submitted, re reload current page or redirect to URL. Redirect to page, display mess. We're going to redirect to URL. And this is where I want to have my. I want to put in this. I want to put in my. Uh, what do you call it? My uh, affiliate link. So that once they sign up, put their info in, boom, goes over to my. Uh, uh, affiliate deal. So what I'm going to do here real quick. Okay. Hello, Miss. Good morning, Mr. Bass Bass. All right. We're just going to remember, log in. I don't need that one. Connecting. Sorry. I'm just go I'm going back in here to get to my affiliate center my affiliate dashboard so I can get my affiliate link and show you how to plug in my affiliate link. So do, 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 affiliate links and there is my URL and then we pop back over here come down into here you got to go for a walk Mr. Boy yeah it's getting to be that time I'm almost done all right, boom. There we go. Hit save. And bada bang, bada boom, folks. What in the heck is that? <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> I want that centered. How in the heck? Edit components. This is awesome. Connect with service. I don't know why it did. Hold on. I got to check something here. I don't want that. That is, let's preview this. Oh, there it is. Okay. We're good. <laughs> I've never seen it do that, folks, where it came out. But this is our new. Really quick, so you know it's taken 20 minutes, but we had one big foo bar, and that was me not going and hitting the nice little green button saying save, always save. All right, but there you go, brand new landing page that I can now take and stick out and send traffic to. So anyway, I hope uh, you guys can see, even after that screw up. Notice, let's see, he's Mr. Lovey Man this morning. Uh, but at the same time, he's telling me it's time for walks. Anyway, uh, yes, you're on camera, sucker. <laughs> um, anyway, even after the, my beautiful blunder, I hope you guys can see just how quickly, when you know and you got the thoughts in, and if you have, like I did, have the the photos, your stuff already right, preloaded. If you know and got an idea of what you're doing, just how quick, like for this landing page, just how quick you can throw something together, you know, and start doing what you want to do instead of using everybody else's cookie cutter stuff. Brand you and make this stuff your own. All right. I'm Dominic Zen. He's got to go for a walk. I'll see you guys on the next video.